VMware Cloud on AWS brings VMware's software-defined data center to AWS Public Cloud. VMware SDDC runs on AWS bare metal infrastructure and is integrated with AWS native services. VMware Cloud on AWS combines VMware's flagship compute, storage, and network virtualization products, including vSphere, vSAN, and NSX, as well as vCenter server and powerful disaster recovery together. It enables IT teams to seamlessly migrate and run business-critical vSphere workloads in a familiar environment, helping them modernize their infrastructure with fully managed VMware Tanzu services and native AWS services. You can use VMware Cloud on AWS to derive instant business values by using the same architecture and operational experience on-premises and on the cloud. VMware Cloud on AWS utilizes NSX to create an overlay network atop the physical layer provided by AWS. An SDDC network has two notional tiers. Tier 0 handles north-south traffic, traffic leaving or entering the SDDC, or between the management and compute gateways. In the default configuration, each SDDC has a single Tier 0 router. Tier 1 handles east-west traffic, traffic between routed network segments within the SDDC. In the default configuration, each SDDC has a separate Tier 1 router for management and compute workloads. The NSX Edge appliance is implemented as a pair of VMs that run in active slash standby mode. This appliance provides the platform on which the default Tier 0 and Tier 1 routers run. Scalable network architecture allows expansion of the default topology by adding custom Tier 1 compute gateways or utilizing the multi-edge SDDC feature. It's time to go through the details about the networking inside of an SDDC. The Management Gateway, MGW, is a Tier 1 router that acts as the default gateway for the appliance and infrastructure subnets. MGW also handles firewalling for management appliances running in the SDDC, controlling access to the vCenter server and NSX manager. The Compute Gateway, CGW, is a Tier 1 router that handles network traffic for workload VMs. You can create multiple CGWs to expand the workload VM network. Now let us take a look at the configuration of uplinks of Tier 0. Internet Uplink. The Internet Uplink provides the SDDC with internet connectivity within the underlay AWS VPC, VPC Uplink. The VPC Uplink connects the SDDC Edge to the cross-linked AWS VPC in the customer-owned AWS account. Direct Connect Uplink. This uplink is used with Direct Connect Private VIF attached to the SDDC. Aside from simplified cloud migration, VMware Cloud on AWS has made it a hassle-free experience to run production applications across on-premises and AWS. Now, make your network a hassle-free experience with VMware Cloud on AWS. Review technical information on TechZone or get hands-on experience with VMware Hands-On Labs.